you are Edochi meets me, Edochi's family. Please, I don't want a divorce. Hello, Nigeria. So welcome back to my YouTube channel. You know, I've not really seen a man like a uh, yellow data before because he is so indecisive. Nobody knows what he wants and nobody knows what he wants to do. You know, he actually wants everything to himself. You know, that is being a, a narcissist. That is what a lot of people are saying. A man that wants everything, that thinks only about himself. He doesn't consider other people. Because if he allegedly really, really considers the feelings of other people, he wouldn't be doing what he's doing now. A man that people advise to allow you to to go, of course, you made a mistake. Your mistakes are, is not something that you cannot correct. That is why May Duchi was giving him time and told him categorically that he, she has forgiven you. She has forgiven you already. That she bears no grudges against you. Of course, we are human beings and we are bound to make mistakes and some other mistakes in life. But one thing is certain that you must right your wrongs. And you, you literally had every opportunity in this particular world to right his wrongs. But he refused to do that. Like I've said, he's the narcissist because he only wants things about himself. He only thinks about himself because had it been he wasn't thinking about himself, he could not have made the mistake at the first place. Because considering how she, he knew that his wife made that she had no problem, he knew that his wife was a very submissive, a lawyer, and a very hardworking lady. He knew already, but because he was too selfish, because he wanted his own pleasure, and he wanted to flirt around with women and everything, he now went and abandoned everything that his wife did for him. His, the, the, the good thing that his wife did for him, he literally abandoned it. And not just that, he literally, because he was too selfish, never considered the feelings of his own wife. He never considered the feelings of me, which he, he, he went ahead, had an affair with Jude Austin, had the, the F-1-3 to impregnate Jude Austin, had the F-1-3 to allow Jude Austin, and Jude Austin gave birth to a baby boy, and had the F-1-3 to go and pay Jude Austin's bride price secretly without his wife's knowledge. That is the height, height of being so selfish and being so uh, being a narcissist. I must really, really tell you. Okay, and when this incident happened, a lot of people called him. Even his uh, senior brothers called him and told him, okay, fine, you're not the best person to do this kind of thing, but don't bring in Jude Austin home. Don't bring in Jude Austin home. You can bring in the newborn baby you have with Jude Austin. Of course, the baby is yours and the baby belongs to you. It, it, there is no issue with that. Of course, me, Doche could actually probably accept to take care of the baby that you had, but don't bring in another wife. But he the Doche because he knew what he was doing. He, because being a narcissist and being so selfish, he still wants to bring in Jude Austin to that house. He doesn't even consider how May Edoche will coexist with such lady. He doesn't even want to consider how May Edoche is feeling or probably how she will be managing the particular family. To tell you that he doesn't even care. Yeah, Edoche still went ahead, you know, ignored the advice that his brother, even his own mother gave him the same advice. Yeah, Edoche ignored the advice that his brother and his mother gave to him and still went ahead to still be flaunting Judy Austin and, and he was still having an affair with Judy Austin despite all the grace that his wife gave to him. He doesn't even know that if May Edoche today wants to sue him and want to imprison him, that May Edoche could have done that. Because what Edoche did was not even polygamy, as he's claiming. What he did or what he committed was bigamy. And according to the constitution of Nigeria, it's punishable according to the constitution of Nigeria. And if someone can be imprisoned for that, bigamy is when a, a man you know, didn't seek for the consent of his own wife to, to take up another wife. Because Edoche should understand that the vow he made to his wife was an agreement. He made an agreement that not to take up a second wife. He made an agreement to his wife to only love his wife and take care of his wife. He has breached the agreement. And you should know that if May Doche really, really want to punish him, May Doche will go to the court and sue him. And definitely, you know, Doche will go in for like seven years for what he did. And that is basically the truth and nothing but the truth. But May Doche is giving him time. And May Doche have told him after you know, Doche tendered that fake apology. Uh, last year that uh, it was a mistake that he made, that he never intended to become a polygamist and that, and that May Doche should forgive him, that nobody is coming to take May Doche's position and nobody is coming to disrespect May Doche. Of course, May Doche read the apology and told him that there's no way that he, he, she doesn't hate him and there's no possible way that she could hate the father of her kids. That the only thing she's asking or demanding from May Yolo Doche is for Yolo Doche to right his wrongs and that ends it. Nothing much and nothing uh, so special about it. But Yolo Deche, because he is so selfish and so self-centered, you know, he decided not to do anything. He doesn't want to let Jude Austin to go. He doesn't want to let May Doche to go. Because he knows that if he allows May Doche to go, ha, a lot of the properties that they acquired will be willed to May Doche. Because May Doche supported him and he probably even gave more contribution to the properties they acquired. So you could see that Yolo Deche doesn't want to lose anything. Meanwhile, he still wants to have everything to his own self. He wants to have Jude Austin probably for, for pleasure and for any other thing. 
he still wants to keep May Doche because he knows that May Doche, if May Doche finally divorces him, that he will lose a lot of properties and everything. Now, recently, Yellow Doche met with uh, May Doche's family because May Doche's family have been warning him because May Doche's family wants to know his position. He can't keep, uh, okay, look at what Judy Austin is doing. Intimidating May Doche, trying to intimidate May Doche, recruiting Sarama fans to join her and recruiting other people to lie against May Doche. And this is making May Doche's family to be angry. That is why they... Uh, called me, uh, called you the teacher, and you the teacher finally met them because they want to know me, you the teacher's position. If you the teacher is no longer interested in the marriage, you the teacher should tell them so that they will return the bride price that he paid. If if you the teacher is not ready to allow the person to go, let you the teacher say so that they will know uh, what they are doing because the, uh, the, the adult are being made, the cannot be in a marriage where she will be intimidated. We are her feelings and uh, her, her decisions will not be respected, and that is just the truth. Yellow Dichi never respected the feelings of uh, uh, of May Dichi. He, he was just so self-centered and so selfish that he, he thought that he could do anything and go scot free. And now he's begging for the May Dichi that he doesn't want to divorce. And that is just the truth. He knows that he, he wouldn't want to divorce May Dichi. Number one, he knows May Dichi is a very classy and a very loyal and a very hardworking and a very good woman. He knows that he cannot lose such lady. And another thing is that he doesn't want to divorce because he knows that if he divorces me, Doche, like I've said, he will lose virtually all the properties he has. And another is that he doesn't even want to let Judy Austin to go. So you could see the level of confusion and how selfish someone could be. He doesn't want to take a drastic decision. He doesn't want to make amends for what he did. He still he just wants everything to himself. He wants everything practically to himself. You know, he doesn't even consider how May Edoche will coexist with somebody like Jude Austin, who is quite uh, competitive, who life loves unhealthy competition and all that and all that. You know, May Edoche doesn't even consider whether May Edoche would actually coexist peacefully with this particular lady. Rather, Yo Edoche is more interested in having the two women because he knows that uh, the money will be coming from May Edoche and uh, probably Jude Austin. And probably he just wants everything to himself. And that is the height of it. But I believe that May Edoche's family is still giving him more time. That a time will come when they will finally file for a divorce. Whether Yo Edoche is ready to sign the divorce or not, we should know that the court can actually sign uh, a divorce and, uh, and you know, uh, proceed for a divorce case, even if Yo Edoche is not willing to sign the case. Because uh, if he refuses, the court, even in his, in his absence, can de declare the marriage as void and everything. Well, I would like you guys to drop your comment in the comment section and you can subscribe to my YouTube channel.